Hey there, everyone. Today I'm gonna play Pac-Man World 2. I do have the first game on PlayStation 1, but I feel like playing the sequel on the GameCube. I'll just let this animated intro show the rest of the scene. So I'll just stop talking right now. That's Spooky, by the way. That's the main villain of the entire game now. Okay, now this is the main menu of Pac-Man. Gummit, he looks pretty cool in this style in this old game. Whoops, I just gotta put on... On load there. Vibration off. Does that going to be annoying? Right, not much else to say about the options. It says credits to end the game. Back to the game. Sound. Okay. That makes it pretty loud. That is so loud. Hold on. Turn down a little bit. Hold on. There. there we go. Even number. Not much else to say, but I do like the great animated style Pac-Man. Speaking of Pac- animation style Pac-Man, I did do like the same animation style Pac-Man being happy by paper. I like to show you guys, but I did not fully cover it in yellow and him having orange gloves and red boots really fits his style since the early 90s. Alright, let's get this started. There's gonna be a new animated intro cutscene. You don't get that many in this game, but you'll see what I mean later on. And he does not talk besides that yawning. Ancestors fought against this very evil. In ancient 
ancient times, the Great Wizard Pack created a powerful potion that turned my fruit from Packland into the golden fruit that was stolen today. Armed with these magical fruit and a great deal of bravery, Sir Packalot faced the all-powerful ghost known as Spooky. Sir Packalot defeated Spooky and imprisoned him. And he has remained there until now. Pac-Man, the golden fruit are in the hands of the devious ghosts, and Spooky is on the loose again. You must retrieve the golden fruit and defeat Spooky, or all of Pac-Land will be doomed. Yeah, that's basically the main plot of the game. It's up to Pac-Man to save his world from the evil Emperor Spooky. Welcome to Packville, the heart of Packland. You have a long adventure ahead of you, but you can always return home for some refreshing. The arcade is building to the right. Sure is a usual, they're taking care of things. She can give you a tour of the Arcade if you like. Now you move important matters. Here's a health wrench. Eat these to share your health. You cannot pick them up if you are hurt. Ah, pack dots. These are another way to gain health. Eat to get one more friend, health friend. It's a valuable extra life. Make sure to search out and grab them. Here a token collecting these will unlock games in the arcade. Don't come to sue in the arcade for more information. Finally, here's the exit from blah 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 blah. Go to now, go Pac Man. Let's go ahead and play the freaking game already. Yep, like everything else you said, you have to collect all of these things to come to first send this game. First things first, let's go in and get one ghost. Get some yummy fruit too, which you did not say. You can use the seed controller. And I do mean the word. E B C word. The controller to move the camera around. I missed it. Pac-Man has ability to have well it's called a bug bounce. Or I'll just call it the Pack Bouncer, because I don't think... I think there's a manual of something called Bounce. In this game, you can collect many types of fruits as possible, just a hunt for a sandwich in the entire game. I remember playing this game as a kid, it was fun as heck. But to be truthful, I did not beat this game even when I was younger, since I had to do kind of interesting things in my life, do an art project. And to this very day, I still do like kinds of Pac-Man artwork. Right? Because who doesn't like the girl classic round ball character that likes eating ghosts for a living? Alright, let's see, um, get this fruit. I like doing the bouncing because it's so much fun to do. Boingy, 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 boingy. Oh, there's an apple. 
Oh yeah, and it shows the high scores. Every time you collect a fruit, you earn that plus high score. Oh yeah, and you press V, high final speed boost. Looks to run quicker. They'll stop uncontrollably when he speeds up, and you hold down B. Yeah, here we go. Whoops. Sometimes they'll be tricky to know when you're gonna land the perfect spot. Oh, fell down again. Just need that melon up there. There's a token up there. Another melon. Let's see, um... And do your stretches there, Paxter. Um, let's see, um... Move the camera. I can't see what's up there. I can't get up there. Yep, you can take the enemies by speeding up like that. Alright, got the token. Just gonna try to get up there. So unlike my other videos, I'm probably gonna make this like an hour long video. Um, I really don't got my jobs to say, but I did enjoy playing this game as a kid back then. I never had a free time exploring this entire peg village. Then collecting things. Trying to see how you're supposed to get up there. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Go up here. Nope, you missed it. Oh, missed. Oh, come on. Sometimes you'll have problems trying to get to the top to be... Oh, he's basically a ball. Yellow pack ball. These edges can be a bit slippery. You're never going to doubt know when you're gonna jump at the right moment. Alright, come on. I got the cherries. Yeah, it shows how many fruits you've got. Okay, I got six. So I'm supposed to collect all six fruits, huh? Uh, man, I missed. How am I supposed to get up there? Okay, let me try your house. Get the fruit. Screw it, we're leaving. Already... You started the gameplay and we haven't got to the real first level yet. Alright, the bare basics. Of course, the puns in this game, just like the other ones. Okay, first things first. Um, I do have this game on Xbox as well. I also got, like, this one. I got Pac-Man Versus and Pac-Man World 2. So basically, there's like both games now. On Pac-Man Versus, you had to connect like the Game Boy Advance toward the... Uh, well, basically, Pac-Man Versus, if you had those connection things. It's been a long time since I have used those as a kid, but... 
I'm kind of used to playing regular Pac-Man games just to, without the connection going on. You know, those kind of things. So, I might have to play this game for like probably an hour. Alright, here we go. Alright, let's collect all these pallets. Now I got me controlling Pac-Man and this one feels very smoothly good. It has very good motion controls. I know how this game works. Now I gotta say the levels, also in this game with the trees and the plants all around, they took their time and effort doing everything in this game pretty well we done. The music sounds very nice, voice acting is not half bad. I just love that classic sound of it. The whoop! I think they also use that sound effect in that street of range. And every time you pull, pick up food, too. Oh, it's called Try the Bud Bounce. And Pac Man Cub. But be careful. Oh, Shrimp Murder the Bear. Or cub. That worked. Pay close attention. However, you may have to use another type of attack to deal with other enemies. Alright, what do you say, sign? Looks like this hill goes to him. Yep, I know what to do here. Oh yeah, these ones can lift you up to the other sides, so Pac-Man can automatically eat those, eat the red one, and they can hover into the air in higher places he can't reach. Alright, so watch out for these spiky plants. Thorny plants, whatever. I do remember when I was a kid, I did get hit by those because I'm not super smart to know that those would damage you. But I try my best to not get hit by anything else I can harm Pac Man in this game. Besides ghosts, that you can only defeat when you get those power pellets. I do remember in a Pac-Man game, which is this one, you can actually swim. Alright, come on. Just gonna get that one. You're never going to know when the are supposed to hit at. Oh yeah, I forgot you can actually jump and kick. I was wondering why they did not bring this back in the other Pac-Man games, so if you can actually... He kick, he jump. Yep, you can hold your breath for a very long time in this on the water. Let's see, um... Okay, you can't hit the crates. Oh, 
all the strawberries collected. Wonderful. Okay, so it's on limited to know how many fruits you have to collect in this game. Look at that treasure chest. Treasure chest can only be open if you have a fruit of the time. Shown on the chest, grab the orange and give it a try. Yep, I already did that. Yep, I'm learning so much. <laughs> Congratulations, you have made it to the level completed. Soon, Italian portal. I'll step into it and you will finish this level. Yep, do your victory dance, Pac Man. Alright, I got eight lives, and of course, I want to save. To be truthful, the first time I ever did play Pac-Man was basically the NES old classic one that's based off the arcade. And then I did play the new Pac-Man Adventures, which is a point-and-click game, which I heard is one of the worst games on there on the sequel of the late early 90s. And then they did Pac-Pac-In-Time on the Super Nintendo, where he goes back in time for some reason. This is a platforming game that we should control him. And I think there was like a puzzle game too. Which is pretty weird. Alright, this one says Canyon Chaos. You know, I did get halfway into the gameplay when I first played Pac-Man World 2, and I think I only got up to, like, World 3, and that's pretty much it. But I did play Miss Pac-Man Maze of Madness on PlayStation 1. Which I find it weird that Miss Pac-Man is on Dreamcast 64 and PlayStation 1. From the early 2000s. And this game is about. Hold on a second. Nearly 18 years old right now, since so it came out in 2003. <clears throat> Third. 2003rd. That kind of explains why the music sounds like this. The music doesn't sound that bad, but this sounds all trumpety like. Also, as a kid, I had no idea what those things are. Are those bugs I just watched? Because that's why their blood is all green. I know they got teeth, but they're dangerous, aren't they? So unlike the ghostly adventures of Pac-Man that you can easily chomp these guys up. On here you can only use the power pallets to eat them. Oh come on, how did I take damage from that? Alright, careful, careful. Going to bonus pits. Look at that. How am I supposed to reach that one? Alright, checkpoint. I don't know how I'm supposed to reach for that token. My hands are all itchy right now. 
Whoa, that was close. Oh yeah, I remember being this giant cartoon bear. When I saw the commercial of it, he bounces on his belly. Okay, that did not work. Okay, let's try this. Okay, that works. Wow, watch out. Okay, so Pac-Man takes one more hit and he's done. Yeah, take that, you stupid bear. Oh yeah, and you collect these and you end up in classic Pac-Man style minigame. Time to abandon you, only get like three lines. If you mess up, you basically go back to the main gameplay. I always have to watch out for these ghosts. And keep Winky and Clyde. Uh, to make sure you collect the fruits or they'll get you. I have to try my best not to get caught by these ghosts. I usually use teleportation. Okay, they got me there. Coming for you. Crap! One life left. If you lose all your lives, you won't get the price you wanted. Alright, here they come. Closer. I did it. Complete it. All right. What price do I get? Golden pack, man. You quite the garrison. Uh, of course. Ooh, and that one breathes fire. But be careful. And I'm dead. Don't tell me I have to start over. Well, I said the game to give me a checkpoint, so I don't have to start over. And get my revenge on that stupid lizard. Yeah, take that. I used to be a reptilian fire and, and punk. Ow. Gotcha. So much pain. Going up. Oh, that's how you get the token up there. Oh, okay. That was close. I don't want to fall into the bonus pit already. I only got seven lives. Stay 
Daddy. Whoa. Good for me. Um. Alright, get the fruit. Oops. Just gonna get the fruit. Hold on, let me see. All right, got all the oranges. I can't see where I'm going. Oh, wow, I'm tiny. Well, that explains why there's a hole there, so give me a tiny mouse. Alright, Peg Dog Pano. I really don't got. Oh, it says Pawn, of course. Ooh, that's a big bug. I really don't like big bugs. They kind of creep me out. It's like I've seen in the uh, King Kong movie. Well, Pierre Jackson's King Kong movie. And he really did freak me out. Now that was a kid back then. Alright, need to see those come in real life. Hey! Okay, I can do that. Let's try that again. This time I'll get the token. Wait. Wait for it. Okay, just leading me to the orange, so... Whatever. Works! Now I gotta say, the graphics look pretty nice on here from old GameCube that came out years ago. By the way, Pac-Man does not talk until they do the third one. Don't want to fall down there. Right where the waterfall is at. Get some yummy cherries because those are my favorite fruits. And me alive too. I don't know if they're soda flavor, I can still have them. Squash you. Careful. Um, how am I supposed to reach that? I grab it. Fun fact, when they were about to do like Pac-Man World 3, it was gonna be like a 
Oh wait, I think they were gonna do like another Pac-Man World game. No, I was right. I was gonna say they were gonna do like Pac-Man World 3 and do like a dumb blurb style, like classic 2D animation. Where everything's gonna be done by dumb blur animation. Whoops, forgot about those. It was gonna look pretty awesome. It let look great. It would have been like the best part of the history, but they kinda canceled that idea. It just stick with well basically Pac-Man saving the world from Trump. Destruction and chaos from the ghost. Come on, grab it. Alright, got the token. I don't know how many more you're supposed to collect in this game, but it's pretty cool. Did not see that one come in. Pause the game. What you just saw is Metal Pac-Man. So they probably got the same idea, same ability from Super Mario 64. So, oh, he give me also metal to be invisible at most parts. You'll get different abilities in this game too. Basically going underwater, of course, giving him slippers and have the ability to breathe underwater. I guess they don't have any fizz kids of um, any video game characters that can hold their breath underwater for a very long time. But anyways, back to the game. So unlike the other Pac-Man games I've played so far, Basically this one. In this sequel, you basically want to make sure you collect everything in this game, sort of speaking. Every time you get those down Z man entities, whatever those things are called, the more you collect those, the more you get playing like the classic Pac-Man arcade game. Which is pretty neat, I guess. If you want to play like the old classic Pac-Man game. Oh well, at least I got the cherry. Take this! Oh, here they come! It can be very tricky to not know when they're going to attack. Watch out for Inky, Drinky, and Clyde. They should all have to be tricky at their directions. A few more to go. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Hurry, hurry. Yes, nailed it. I did it. Success. And they got the same idea from Mario. Too doesn't last long.
All right, enough messing around. Let's keep going. I actually like this one better than the first one. go. Well, I'll try again. Or down to my five lives. Already like a half hour into this gameplay and I already lost three lives now. So like I said, I'll play this game for like an hour. Should not take too long to play. All right, steady, steady. Gets kind of tricky to know when you're gonna hit that mark right about now. Or I could do this. Nope. Crap! I did that too soon. You had to time it perfectly and don't end up like I just did already. Am I supposed to get to the other side? I keep dying. Rent and repeat so many times. Come on. I'm tired of this. I know it's a video game, but you can at least make it easier. Since when does this game turn all Crash Bandicoot? No! How am I supposed to reach for that?
Am I ever gonna beat this level or not? I'm already losing like all my lives because this level is tough. In many lines, I finally made it. Blinky's Care of Frog. Wow, we already had the boss? I know this game is not super long, but sheesh. Pac Man. Spooky says you can't have that golden fruit thingy. I can't. And Froggy Tunnel, Long to get ya. Long to get on. But bounce on it. Thanks for it? That can't be obvious. Yep, I do remember fighting this boss many times as a kid. Because it's not too hard. So do you know the right one to jump on its tongue? Also, when did he start building a giant robotic frog so fast already? Also, once he's done using wood, he uses metal, and you have to aim for its UV law. A big frog tongue. I'll get you with something that can't break. See, so you can deal with this deal. Don't even think of thing. What's that thinking thing in its mouth? Well, basically, it's you, Vila. Alright. Here we go. Here it comes. You have to hit it right away before or his tongue comes back in. Now I gotta admit, this is one of my most favorite boss fights in Pac-Man history. Because it's super easy to hit his attacks. And it glows, just to know when you're supposed to hit it. Well, that was simple. And I didn't take damage. The Golden Cherry. One down. Four more to go. Because there's only four ghosts in this Pac-Man game playing world. Alright, on toward the woods stage. Be doing woods. Like I said, I'll be playing this for like a whole hour. Or gameplay. Yep, now we get to one of my most favorite stages in video game history. Bouncing on these high, bouncy trampolines. As a kid, I had fun doing these ones so many times because that's who doesn't like to jump on super bouncy trampolines. Target. And the music sounds really good on here. It sounds amazing. The thing that kind of frights me about this thing is big huge pits. Big bombless pits, so be careful not to fall in. I'll give this game some credit, they 
didn't make the first stage a little bit too easy for me, but now in the second stage it gets a little bit a little trickier and a little bit tougher to not fall down. Because Pac-Man can be a little bit slippery at times to control. So they move very fast. I'm pretty sure you can probably beat this game of Pac-Man World 2 in maybe four or five hours. Just depends if you don't screw up like I did. Keep falling to the fallen pits. See what that uh, did. Uh, no thanks. Hey, watch it. Stupid bug. I got the apple. Let's see if I'll open that treasure chest. A gal again. And you already know what this means. More of this. Okay, there. I'm making this one extra long this time. Man, we got two lines. Oh, jeez. I get the fruit. Here they come. All right, steady. Oh, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Oh, oh, oh. oh. I'm sitting on my own foot right here. Ah. Ow, I can't to stand up now. Ha 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 ha, come here. Look at me, Pinky. Like me now, suckers. Quickly, this way. Now! Ha <laughs> ha! In your faces! Right, this way. Alright, hurry! Huh, oh, you almost got me. Damn it! I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Yeah, you're not so tough now, are you? All right, got a few more left. Take a shortcut. Yes! I win. Victory is mine. Whoa, watch it, buddy. I'm trying to not die here. Wow. 
watching you right beside your bum. Ah, hey! Don't use your sharp teeth. You want somebody? That's not nice. All right, got an extra life. There's a token over there. Ugh, that was close. Okay, um... Uh, all right. Just gonna move the camera. So I know where I'm gonna jump at. Try and get the fruit. Okay, no. Uh, it's already scaring me. Oh, okay, okay, all right. That was close. Wait a minute, I forgot I can kick and do that. Oh, hold on. Ugh. These big, huge eyes really scare me if I'm gonna fall into the baller's head. I just get the fruits. Careful. It's a long way down, so don't want die this way. It's a little trickier to know when you're gonna land at the perfect spot without falling to your death. Alright, steady. Damn it! I knew it. I knew I was gonna fall down. So you know what that means? I have to start over. Or just leave. I don't care. I got extra life back. Get the same stupid token again. Because the game really wants you to repeat this crap again. Stupid level! Ow. Hold still. Well, at least the game is nice enough to give you extra limes every time you die. Alright, careful. I want to do it again, come on. Careful. Missed it. Come on. Careful. Just want to time it perfectly. I want to press A too soon, or you'll have to redo it again. Because there's no checkpoints. We have to do this again. Come on. Right, 
be closer with the apple. All right, one, two, three, jump! Oh crap! No, you don't. Oh, thank goodness for a checkpoint. Oh, hold on. Definitely need those. Yep, here I come. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Mm, yummy. We go three munching time. Hurry, he's about to change back. Go, Pac Man, go. <laughs> go for it, man. <laughs> go, yellow dude. Yes, made it. Also, already an hour. We're in two minutes in. Oh, yeah, and I forgot to say something. Happy Father's Day. And because I forgot we're on the 20th. It's usually on the 20th. Usually, Father's Day is always on the 20th. I don't know why it's that way, but it doesn't matter now. Anyways, on with the gameplay. Ooh, big saws. Oops. Violent. Yeah, this is exactly what I'm talking about. Pac-Man controls a little bit slippery in this game. Watch it. Oh, great, now we're playing on the other sides of it. Like this game wasn't tough enough already. I always hate these boss saws that just do nothing but be at the same spots, just like in most video games. That kind of remind me of. Donkey Kong Country Free. Ain't those big saws that want to cut you in half? Yeah, I always hated those. And I kinda hate it when video games force you to uh, reach for the iron by making you almost make a leap of faith of death. Yep, screw that. Whatever's down there, forget it. Just grab these. Dun 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 dun. Whoa. The faster I can get through this level, the faster I can probably get to stop recording this gameplay in like an hour and 20 minutes, 30 minutes. It just depends if I want to end the gameplay. Made it. I wish fruits can kill you in this game, but they can't. Whoa! Oh, Nelly. And I'm dead anyways. They were gonna kill me with their poison dots, and I'm already dead. Ow! No fair flying. Crap.
Don't shoot me at my yellow behind. Wait for it. Go. Whoa, that thing goes very fast. Um, hold on. Get the token. Got 33 so far, except the one I missed it. I don't want to make a leap of faith of death there. Nope. Nope, can't reach that. Okay, what's over here? Okay, we're in the right track, and there's one bear there. And one token I will not risk my life getting. Alright, gotta be careful here. Wow, I can't believe I actually got it. Alright. Sometimes the camera will be a problem that I can barely see in front of me before it's too late. Wow, that was actually quick. That was actually really fast. Let's see, blood and pain. Okay, I can see why. Ooh, different soundtrack playing. All right, I'm Metal Pac-Man. So, now there's gasoline. Films happening. Oh, both those can't hurt me now. So I'm basically invisible for a short moment of time. I had to go back and press that button again. And I'm back to regular Pac-Man. Okay, might as well. Careful. Don't fall. Careful. What are you doing? Ow. Made it. Oh, thank goodness for that. And there's a token over there. Of course there's a token. I did not see that one coming. Well, Pac-Man strikes again. Well, at least it won't hurt me. Here we go. Mm. 
And down I go. Oh, come on! Are you kidding me? I can't see. And I'm dead. Oh, this is not good. Oh boy, I'm rolling to like a ball here. Whoa. Wow, this seems almost unfair. Yeah, for the tall trees. Okay, I did not see those there. Got one last hit left. I have... I wish I had the middle. Oh, never mind. Okay, hurry. I ain't gonna last long. Yep, now I know these fuels are like burned Pac Man's flesh, so we don't want that to happen. Yes. Checkpoint. What's happening? Oh, bats. That's not good. Not the bats. Anything but bats. Oh, wait, I can jump and kick. I always did not like tight ropes in video games. And they got me. At the time I got that, whatever that was. Okay, it was a token. Yes! Oh, thank God for another checkpoint. I think I'm almost getting closer. That's the end of the level. Since this is an older game, it, 
That means I'm getting closer by now. It's like I lost all my lights. Music sounds very nice, by the way. Ow. Run the nose again. Yes, I'm, I made it. Love how they play that old music. All right, I made it. Finally got to the ice. Well, getting close to the icy world level. Inky's light all great old Matic. Oh yeah, I remember hearing this awesome music. Came for the golden fruit, Pac-Man? Spooky wanted me to think of a good top down of you ever got to me. I think my saw blades should do the trick. Hmm, maybe. Oh, Alright, this one. Whoa! We have to do the mouth first and then jump on his head. I think you're pretty smart, don't you? I'll knock you off the platform. Oh, that's not a good idea. Now we have to jump on his head. Just gonna wait until he comes over here. And he did knock me off the platform. Good thing I still got a few limes left. And yep, once you die in the boss fight, you have to... Well, at least you don't have to redo the fight again. It's kind of tricky to know when he's gonna start attacking you at the right moment. I didn't remember being him before, and somehow he has that amazing giant robot. Still spinning around like crazy. Yes, I got him! Looks like you could still use a close shave. Really, that's all you can say, huh? Alright, wait. for it. Oh, got him. Yeah, every time you die in a boss fight, you can still go find him pretty well. Mm. Yep, same line again. Come on. No, 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 no. Don't fall down. Ha, <laughs> missed. Mm. Yes, I beat him. After dying from him twice. Oh, three times, maybe. Have to look up the video later. 
A golden strawberry. Finally. Two down, two more to go. And we finally made it to the icy stage level. Icy River Run. As a kid, I did not like icy levels because they felt too slippery. Oh good, the cutscene finally. Pac-Man, it's great to see you. Everything around here was... ...pinks and spooky. And the ghosts stole the golden fruit. Ghosts have been seen all around the mountain. Watch out for the rural rams. They are mean. You might get them a taste of their own medicine. Come to... Thanks. Thanks for the heads up. Um, Ranger? Or Pac-Man? Yeah, take that. Yeah, eat it. Now we're in the icy level snow stage. Alright, if I beat this one, I can go in and end the game play here. I don't want to beat this game right away, because it's actually not that long. Oh. I'm wondering why they want me to do this, but it's the bouncing springs are back. I know you don't. <laughs> yeah, how you like me now? Oh, all right, can't go that way. By the way, in this icy level, you want to make sure he doesn't fall into icy water. Because if he falls in, it's instant death. I try not to fall in, but it gets a little tougher to not stand on slippery ice. If you jump on those, they don't make a slippery sound. And you won't have control over Pac-Man when you feel that moment of slipping. Go! Yep, I can see the ghost. Gotcha! Hey! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I don't want to fall in. Heads up! Yeah, take that, you stupid ram. Haha, <laughs> you missed me. Whoa! Oh, not good. Oh, I see a tree over there. No, 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 no! Ow! Yeah, forget it. Watch out! Wow. Heh, <laughs> can't get me right here. By the water. Heh <laughs> heh. 
Én nem értem. Why you only get these right in front of him? Yeah, whatever. Er, damn it! See, that's what I exactly I'm talking about. Right, I'm gonna kill you this time. Gotcha! I have you now. Yeah. And I missed. All right, I made it. I get the pallets. I say get the pallets. That's why our Pac-Man doesn't want to eat them. He just doesn't want to grab all of them. All right, the game does have problems. He won't even get them if he feels like getting them. Nope, no, 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 damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn, shit. Very slippery. Really? Really? Really, Pac-Man? Really? You really want me to make this even harder for you? I don't see why he doesn't just, I don't know, open wide his mouth and grab all of them. Oh wait, it's the eyes. He starts going up and down until he keeps messing them. Stupid fish. You know, probably got my wish. I'm probably gonna make this an hour and 30 minutes then. Still here, still dying a lot here. A lot more. Come on. Stop wasting my time and grab the stupid dots. Come on. Are you serious? I mean, walk back and forth for these damn things. Ow. Yeah, whatever. Come on. Good checkpoint. Why can you not give me extra? Never mind. Are they really want to make me keep doing this?
Oh no. Alright, come on. Stop rolling to a ball. It's right there. Grab the checkpoint! Oh great, he's throwing snowballs at me. Got to know, little punk. No, you don't. What's with your problem, Rant? Why do you not want visitors to be here? Son of a bitch! I just want to end this already. Why can't there just be, oh, I don't know, like the end of the level already, so I want to keep doing this. Don't care. Oh well, good, it's not a ra not a stupid ram that's being an annoying threat. Oh crap. Oh crap. Hurry! And I'm dead. There's nothing I can do. <clears throat> I'm not talking right. Nothing I can do about it. Once you step on the slippery ice, you're basically dead at this point. Well, aren't I a beeping idiot? Of course, I didn't tell you what. Where you're going to go, and there's the polar bear. Yeah, yeah, you stupid polar bear. Finally. Okay, so far so good. Okay, I think I've played enough of this game already. Let's go back to the main menu. Don't got much else to say, but I like it how he kicks around the title of the gameplay in Pac-Man World 2. So that's it. I played a whole hour and 30 minutes of this game. Oh, well, it's gonna be like an hour and 35. Hey, man. What the hell's that thing? Is that a cartoon weasel in the background? I've never seen that in the forest level. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I know what that is. Okay, I like how there's a ghost high in the log there. Um, oh, it says right here, it says came out in 2002, that's why the game's graphics are like this. But then again, the GameCube did start in 2001. When they stopped doing like 64 games since 2001. Yeah, I really don't got much else to say, but that was Pac-Man World 2. Glad you enjoyed me play this game for a while now. Those of you had a great Father's Day, turning your parents there, are watching this video. Happy Father's Day to you too, this holiday. I'll see you guys next time when I play another interesting GameCube game that does involve of a paper cutout character. 
Uh, also has black dot for eyes. I do like the music, the voice acting doesn't ha sound that bad at times. Seriously, I don't ever see in that weasel character in the game at all. As an enemy. Oh well. I'll see you guys next time. I'll just go ahead and do what I always do. Take the memory card. Yep. This classic Pac-Man chomping style to the 80s. Oh, that's it. Everything basically looks the same, so I don't got much else to say. Hey, else. See you guys next time. And... On my next Let's Play games. Please leave a like, subscribe, comments, and more views of my gameplays in the near future. Sunday I'll continue playing Paper Mario Thousand Year Old Door. Well, I think I'll just go ahead and end the game. Game play and the video here. See you then, everyone. Goodbye. E for now. Have a great summer. Or out there.